Hi folks, this is Max from uh, GalaxyNote2Root.com So today I'm going to show you how to reset your counter um, just in case you need to return your phone for warranty. Um, you can check this by turning off your phone. If you root it, your phone um, using my methods, you probably have increased the binary count. Um, but you can check this by turning off your phone, holding down volume down, center home, and the power button until the warning screen comes up and hit volume up and it should say um, if you have if you need to do this it should say um, you know yes and with the four counts now if you wanna go ahead and hold down the power button to reboot if you want to reset it you can download and use uh, triangle away app on the market um, I highly recommend you buy the donate no donation version um, because you know the developer but Train Fire worked really hard and also it's compatible with all the Samsung devices if you get a new phone um, it will be compatible with your new Samsung device and you'll be able to use it without buying it again and also you can download it free if for some reason you cannot um, access the Play Store I'll have a link to the XDA thread you just have to sign up for XDA uh, it's free and you can download the APAK file and install it also so let's go ahead and download this um, let's go find triangle away uh, there we go triangle away app alright I'm just gonna buy this and then show you oh let me buy it real quick here we go it's installing and uh, you can always get a refund if you don't like it within the 30 minutes or something um, so open it make sure you hit grant uh, please confirm make sure um, your model is the same as uh, the one I do have a N7100 continue and it says uh, I need to uh, download the add-on so go ahead and download the add-on and pretty much run it and it will reset your counter and uh, Samsung will not be able to tell you uh, root your phone now here's the thing most of the US carriers now if you're using it you know by the time you see this video maybe you're trying to use it on the US carriers um, they use usually use uh, a, a, a separate insurance company that deals with all the returns and they don't actually check for the bi binary account uh, by the time they actually get your phone it's actually been disassembled and the only thing they actually check for is uh, water leaks damages for all the US phones um, I'm talking about water leaks or any hardware damages you you know you dropped your phone um, but uh, they don't actually check for this alright thanks Alright, um, alright, I right, just do reset flash counter, alright, and hit continue, and that should reset, uh, reset it, so I'm going to do that, and this also works on Galaxy S3s, most of the Galaxy, all the Galaxy S3s actually, and the triangle way, just don't use it, um, just for the hell of it. I mean, only use it if you're going to return your phone for warranty. And again, most likely, you're not going to have to use it if you're in the U.S. And also, you know, even if you're somewhere else, most of the time they don't actually check it. So long as you have unrooted your phone and then um, unrooted your phone and put put stock ROM on there. Oh, there we go. So hit volume up to reset counter. So I'm going to hit volume up, and this is resetting counter and status. And that's all it's doing. And uh, we can double check this after it boots. Anyway, this is, uh, you know, I don't really rec, I just want to show you how to do it, but it really, no one really checks for this. As long as you unroot your phone back to stock ROM, uh, people at the store, they don't actually, they're not that smart. They don't even know how to root phones most of the time. Unless they're really into it and, you know, been watching my videos. Uh, but I just want to show you how to do it because there are some people that complain like, Oh, you a root method, you can't reset binary account. It's, you know, there's a lot of trolls that do that. Um, so that's why I'm making this video. That you can if you want to. Not not that it really matters, you know. Um, I've never heard of a case where Samsung wouldn't take warranty because they found the binary account. Um, the reason is they didn't actually check it. So now it's done. Let's go check it. It should say zero now. Power off and go down to volume up center and the power button. And uh, um, now you can, after you run this, you can run 
um, the Unroot method, which I haven't posted yet, but I should have it up at um, Galaxy Note 2 root. So go ahead and hold down volume down again, center, and the power button. Hold it down until you see the warning screen, and then hit volume up. And then you'll see that it's gone. It says no Samsung official. Um, system still says custom, but once you unroot and install a stock ROM, it'll say Samsung official also. Anyway, uh, that's how you use Triangle Away app to reset your counter in case you're paranoid. Again, this is not necessary for using the phone. Um, you know, if you feel really paranoid, you can do it when you return your phone for warranty. Uh, for most US, uh, I don't actually recommend it at all uh, because you don't really need to. But you know, maybe other parts of the world they do check it or something. So anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. If you have a Galaxy Note 2, uh, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynote2root.com. We update you uh, once a week with Ronald Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, it's a great way for you to get in contact with me and others if you have trouble with your phone. And thanks you get, thanks guys again for watching my video. Um, if you if this has helped you understand the phone better. Always don't forget to hit that like button for me here, subscribe button up there or wherever it is, and uh, stay high on Android, and uh, I'm going to make more videos now. See y'all later.